Hi, I'm Derek Melber, Technical Evangelist for the AD Solutions team here at Manage Engine. In this video, I want to give you some tips on how you can take your service account attack surface and reduce it to a dramatic effect so that the attacker has to know exactly where to go in your Windows environment to hack into the service accounts. Now, we all know that service accounts often are granted elevated privileges when installed, but these service accounts are only used on a handful of computers. So the very first tip that I'm going to give you is when you go into your service accounts, you can go to the properties of the service account, the account tab, and then specify the log on to option here. Instead of all computers, simply list only those computers that that account can log into. Really, that account is used. Now, the other tip that I can give you is not only can you set the log on to, what you want to set is user cannot change password. Really, we're not talking about a real human here. So service accounts don't have fingers to reset passwords. And what we don't want is for someone to do a denial of service attack on a service account. If they were to find the password, then they could reset the password, causing a disruption in service. So configuring these two settings for all of your service accounts will give you an advantage to reduce the overall attack surface that attackers have for these privileged accounts, which we really need to protect. This has been Derek Melber. Thanks for watching.